AC TIG in easy mode as described in the top there. So we've got the menu tree across the middle with the various parameters and main amps window in the middle there. We're going to go from left to right or right to left depending on which arrow you hit. They'll both get you where you need to go. And we can go in and we can change the parameters as described in the bottom. You can see it's given us the information in the center there. Changing tungsten size. Next is work thickness. Somewhat dependent on tungsten size. Bigger tungsten, you can get bigger materials within the range of the machine. We've then got two types for the filler material. Two different grades that are commonly used. The machine's got five pre-stored settings for the different joint types. As you can see, both a graphical representation and also a descriptor in the middle there. Our next setting is pulse level. Off is an option, but if you want some, we've got five pre-programmed pulse settings within the machine. The pulse percentage in terms of the amperage is preset as is the pulse time on. So it's just a case of those different frequency settings to have a play with. We've then got the remote trigger options, the usual 2T40, we've got pedal, and then you've got two remote control devices, 2T and finger control, 4T and finger control, remote amp torch, etc. Over to OK, giving us our set amperage for this particular joint, 2.4 mil tungsten, 3 mil material on an edge, as an example. A little bit more information on the screen for you. We've got the gas flow recommended, and then also cup size for the ceramic. And last but not least, we do have the ability to trim in the center there, a total of 10 amps up, 10 amps down for a 20 amp swing as a trim device.